All right, we have, we have a whole new group of new members to induct into the Academy tonight. This is very exciting. I'm Marsha McNutt. I'm president of the National Academy of Sciences. It's my pleasure to welcome you to the 154th annual meeting, present presentation ceremony for our new members and foreign associates who were all elected in 2016. This ceremony is being live webcast and we welcome our viewers from across the U.S. and abroad. I'll begin by introducing each new member and reading a short segment of his or her scientific contributions as each new member signs the registry book over on the next table. Our Home Secretary, Susan Wessler, will greet members as they sign the registry. Our Foreign Secretary, John Hildebrand, will greet the new foreign associates. So, I see people are lined up, so let's begin. <laughs> All right. Ian Agel. Agel's studies have solved major conjectures about the topology and geometry of three-dimensional spaces. First one has to be the guinea pig. Okay, Obey Ashtakar. Ashtakar developed loop quantum gravity, a theory that unifies general relativity with quantum physics. Julia Bailey Saris. Bailey Saris studies. <laughs> Bailey Saris studies into how plants tolerate submersion benefits millions of farmers living in flood prone regions. Bonnie Bartell. Bartell's research has elucidated how plant cells compartmentalize metabolism to control growth and development. Helen Blau. Blau studies revealed that silent genes could be activated, enabling fields such as stem cell biology. John Boothroyd. Boothroyd studies on trypanosomes and toxoplasma provided insight into how single cell parasites cause disease. <laughs> Miles Brown. Brown studies into steroid receptors have informed the understanding and treatment of breast and prostate, prostate cancers. <laughs> James Bull. Our 
understanding of evolution owes a debt to Bull's discoveries with viruses and sex determination. Roberto Carr. Carr uses simulations of material dynamics to solve key problems in materials physics and chemistry. Catherine Cashman. Cashman developed innovative methods to illuminate the chemical and physical factors of volcanic eruptions. <laughs> Arup Chakraborty. Chakraborty combined theory and computation with experiments to advance our understanding of immunology and vaccination. Andrew Churlin. Sherlin's research into social demographics revealed how marriage reflected socioeconomic, socioeconomic inequality. Oh. <laughs> Eileen Crimmins. Crimmins' pioneering work in sociobiological science improved our understanding of life expectancy and population health. <clears throat> Constantine da Fermos. De Fermos's mathematical leadership has improved our understanding of hyperbolic conservation laws. <laughs> Hongji Dai. Dai pioneered carbon-based nanosciences that made broad impact to chemistry, physics, and materials, and biomedical sciences. <laughs> Joseph Derisi. Derisi pioneered genomic technologies for the investigation of a wide range of infectious diseases. <laughs> Raymond Deshaies. Deshaies discovered key components that mediate trafficking and degradation of proteins in cells. <laughs> Vladimir Drinfeld. Drinfeld proved an important case of Langland's conjecture and introduced quantum groups. <laughs> Dr. 
Jennifer Eberhardt. Eberhardt's studies have shown how racial stereotypes infuse our society, particularly the criminal justice system. <laughs> James Elringer. Elringer's research into plant physiology is critical to relating how ecosystems will respond to climate change. John Eiler. Eiler's breakout methods of examining multiply substituted stable isotopes have revolutionized the field of geochemistry. <laughs> Stephen Evans. Evans' contributions to probability theory have advanced fields as diverse as population biology and linguistics. <laughs> Martin Fair. Fayer pioneered developments in nonlinear optical devices, enhancing communications, sensing, and precision measurements. <laughs> Stephen Forrest. <laughs> Forrest is a pioneer in the fields of organic light emitting diodes and organic photovoltaic technologies. <laughs> Richard Friesner. <laughs> Friesner's novel computational methodologies have solved important problems in biology, material science, and drug discovery. Ronald Germain. <laughs> Germain's live imaging of immune cells revealed how host defense is orchestrated in vivo. <laughs> James Giovannoni. Giovannoni identified critical genetic and epigenetic regulators of fruit ripening. <laughs> Robert Glazer. Glazer started a revolution in structural biology by developing new methods of electron microscopy. <laughs> Mary Lou Garano.
Guarano studies how plants absorb metals to help improve nutrition for billions of people worldwide. <laughs> Oliver Hart. Hart originated the theory of incomplete contracts transforming our understanding of the allocation of ownership rights. <laughs> Dennis Hartman. Hartman's studies have provided critical insight into greenhouse gases and climate change. <laughs> Jeffrey Heal. Heal has shown how microeconomics can reveal the value of environmental services such as forest conservation. <laughs> Timothy Heckman. Heckman's research has observed how galaxies and supermassive black holes evolve together. Nathaniel Haynes. Haynes has removed barriers to functional characterization of specific cell types in mammalian brain. <laughs> Philip Peter. Peter dissected chromosome structure and function in yeast and applied this knowledge to cancer biology and treatment. <laughs> Hopi Hoekstra. Hoekstra has revealed how changes to DNA and environment lead to physical and behavioral adaptation. <laughs> Wayne Hu. Whose examination of cosmic background forces enabled today's era of precision cosmology? <laughs> Judith Irvine. <laughs> Irvine's studies have revealed how linguistic practices shape and reflect social hierarchy, inequality, and ideology. <laughs> Peter Jones. <laughs> Jones showed how inhibiting DNA methylation can be used for cancer therapy.
Michael Keston. Keston studies elucidated mechanisms of cellular responses to DNA damage and other cellular stresses. Robert Kingston. <laughs> Kingston researches how packaging of the human genome impacts cellular development and body patterning. <laughs> Kenneth Kinsler. Kinsler's analysis of DNA and gene expression helped us to understand why cancer tumors develop. <laughs> Igor Klebanov. Klebanov studies of gravity and gauge theory have had significant impact in various applications. <laughs> Eugene Koonin. Kunin develops new computational approaches to understand the evolution of life. <laughs> Rob Krumloff. Krumloff helped reveal how species use molecular toolkits to form diverse brain and facial structures. <laughs> Clark Spencer Larson. Larson's studies of human skeletal biology have revealed the impact of agriculture on human societies. <laughs> Marsha Lester. Lester utilizes laser spectroscopy to characterize chemical pathways for key atmospheric oxidation processes. <laughs> Andrea Liu. Liu's pioneering contributions provide fundamental new understanding regarding how matter can be organized. <laughs> Hazel Marcus. Marcus's work reveals how culture shapes the sense of self and the consequences of psychological functioning. <laughs> Susan Marcuse.
Marcuse's experiments observed proteins folding from one dimension into complex functional shapes. Songjin Meng. <laughs> Meng developed important vaccines for livestock and discovered animal hepatitis E viruses that infect humans. <laughs> Christopher Monroe. Monroe developed techniques to use individual atoms to advance the field of quantum information science. <laughs> Kenneth Murphy. Murphy's work defined the rules governing T cell differentiation in responses to pathogens. <laughs> Susan Murphy. Murphy developed new fundamental statistical methodologies to improve care for people suffering from chronic illnesses. <laughs> Krishna Nayogi. Nayogi's research on how plants protect themselves from excess light transformed our understanding of photo protection. John O'Keefe. O'Keefe's studies of the hippocampus revealed how animals, including humans, create mental maps of locations. <laughs> Stephen Palumbi. Columbia uses genomic analysis to understand the population biology, evolution, and conservation of marine ecosystems. <laughs> Claire Parkinson. Parkinson's research on polar sea ice has helped reveal and quantify its substantial satellite era changes. <laughs> Steven Pinker. Pinker illuminated the acquisition, evolution, and structure of language and its relation to human nature. <laughs> Hit a plug. Luke discovered how the immune system identifies friends and foes and how viruses like herpes avoid detection. <laughs> Marine Ramo. <laughs> Marine Ramo. 
Ramo illuminates modern climate change by studying the history and causes of climate change in the past. Ares Rosakis. Rosakis's work on materials fractures has had critical influence on aeronautics, spaceflight, microelectronics, and seismology. David Sabatini. <laughs> Sabatini's discovery of the mTOR cellular growth pathway provided new insights into nutrition and disease. <laughs> Melanie Sanford. Sanford's research focuses on developing efficient and sustainable methods for synthesizing diverse types of molecules. <laughs> Robert Shapiri. Shapiri is a world leader in machine learning and co-inventor of the boosting methodology. <laughs> Paul Siegel. Siegel studies earthquakes and volcanoes to improve our understanding of these natural hazards. <laughs> Amita Segal. Segal studied fruit flies to develop key insights into the genetic basis of sleep and circadian rhythms. <laughs> Geraldine Seydoux. Seydoux studies how single-cell embryos break symmetry to develop into complex, multicellular adults. <laughs> Frederick Sigworth. Sigworth studies life's transistors, the ion channel proteins that regulate electrical currents across biological membranes. <laughs> Paul Slovic. Slovic studies revealed that people's evaluations of risk are strongly determined by a variety of personal and contextual factors. <laughs> Pamela Soltis.
Solt has helped revolutionize our understanding of the evolution of flowering plants. And Stone. Stone's studies of modern and ancient DNA examine evolutionary history of humans and their pathogens. Patrick Stover. Stover studies B vitamin metabolism and DNA replication to reveal methods of preventing human diseases. Michael Summers. <laughs> Summers' research into how HIV and other retroviruses disguise themselves paves the way for new treatments. <laughs> C. Megan Yuri. Yuri's study of the quasars generated by black holes helped establish a unified model for active galaxies. <laughs> Herbert Virgin IV. Virgin's research into chronic infections provided insight into viruses, the virome, and immunity. Larry Wasserman. Wasserman has brought his statistical insight to collaborations in astrophysics, genetics, and other fields. <laughs> Peidong Yang. Yang brings to life new nanoscale materials with important electronic and optical capabilities. <laughs> Stephen Young. By combining cardiology with molecular genetics, Young discovered the genetic basis for elevated triglycerides. <laughs> Alexander, Alexander Zemel. Zamolodchov. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Zamolodchov's leadership has influenced quantum field theory, string theory, and condensed matter physics. Gary Zank. <laughs> Gary, 
Zank studies have illuminated the interaction of solar matter with interstellar material and cosmic rays. So at this point, we're going to transition from our members to our foreign associates, and I welcome John Hildebrand, who is our international secretary, who will welcome the uh, new foreign members. We begin with Angie Shin. Anne's pioneering studies of monsoons and other natural processes provided insight into human-caused environmental change. <laughs> Anton Burns. Burns genetic engineering of mice deepened our understanding of the genes and cellular processes related to cancer. Adrian Bird. Bird's pioneering research has answered critical questions about how DNA modifications impact health and disease. Andrew Fabian. Fabian's studies of black holes has illuminated how the gases between galaxies heat and cool. <laughs> Julio Fernandez. Fernandez's work has deepened our understanding of the formation and evolution of comets. <laughs> Danielle Frankel. Frankel uses elegant computational simulations to predict the development of new soft matter materials. <laughs> Stefan Hell. Hell pioneered super-resolution fluorescence microscopy, providing images at nanometer resolution with focused visible light. Jean Giselle. Giselle's research has allowed us to look at Antarctic ice cores to understand past climate changes. <laughs> Antonio Lanzavecchia. Lanzavecchia. Lanzavecchia's studies on the human immune system lead the way to new therapies and vaccines. Wolfgang Lutz. Lutz 
Boots's work has shown how climate change will affect future populations and well-being. <laughs> Arthur MacDonald. McDonald's experiments resolved the solar neutrino problem by demonstrating that neutrinos changed their flavor. <laughs> Yuval Perez. Perez and nearly 200 collaborators have not so randomly addressed nearly every aspect of probability. <laughs> Christine Petit. T improved our understanding of hearing mechanisms through a neurogenetic approach based on hereditary deafness. <laughs> Hugh Possingham. Cossingham combined decision sciences with ecology, government, and organizational behavior to revolutionize conservation efforts. <laughs> Gabriel Adrian Rabinovich. Rabinovich's study of proteins called galactins revealed new understanding of the immune and vascular systems. Okay. Nancy Reed. Reed's vital contributions to theoretical statistics have helped other researchers to infer better results from statistical data. <laughs> Gen Suva. Sua's field discoveries and analyses of ancient hominids have deepened our understanding of human origins. <laughs> Claire Voisin. Poisson's work covers most aspects of algebraic geometry, geometry, algebra, and topology. <laughs> Stephen West. West has made groundbreaking discoveries in DNA recombination and repair and links to human disease. <laughs> Ian Wilson.
Wilson has performed paradigm shifting work on immune recognition of pathogens like influenza and HIV. So now we have uh, a few members who were elected uh, prior to 2016, but for various reasons were uh, unable to be here to sign the book. So uh, first of all, a foreign associate uh, elected in 2015, Fabiola Gianotti. Gianotti from Italy was elected in 2015, serves as the di Director General at the European Organization for Nuclear Research. She led the Large Hadron Collider's Atlas scientific team in discovering and characterizing the Higgs boson. Next, we have a member elected in 2008, Francis Arnold. Uh, Francis is a profes professor of chemical engineering, bioengineering, and biochemistry at Caltech. Her pioneering work in directed evolution protein engineering enabled the discovery of a valuable new enzymes. So let's have one final round of applause for our new members and foreign associates. Now, I talked to many new members who were afraid to have too many glasses of wine at dinner because they didn't want a trip going across the stage. Now you have no excuse. We have a reception afterwards out in the Great Hall, so please join me in the Great Hall to have a toast to the new members. Thank you all very much.